Hey guys, welcome to your new love reading for um, Pisces. This is going to be for your October 2024. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. So we are going to take a look and see what is going on with you guys in love first. And then we will take a look at the new person, the new love that you're dealing with, or that you could be dealing with in the future. See what you need to know about this person. Apply this to your own unique situations, your own timelines. Okay, this could also be a future event. Um, you may switch the roles if you want. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Anyone interested in booking a personal reading with me, the link for that is also in the description box below. Okay, so tell me about Pisces. What's going on with Pisces here? New love for Pisces for October 2022, 2022, 2024. I'm going backwards. What's going on with Pisces in love for October 2024? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Pisces. So we have the Knight of Cups. All right. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Temperance, Sagittarius energy. King of Wands, Aries, Little Sagittarius energy. I feel like there's a situation here where someone here is trying to gain your trust here. Okay. Whoever this person is, I feel like there's a situation here. I feel like maybe you feel very safe with this person. You know, this person could be someone here who's very adventurous, very fun, very spontaneous, goes for what they want. But also this person can be very sensitive, very empathetic, very romantic here. All right. It seems like, oh, be careful with this individual here. It seems like your guides are warning you against this person because this person is not trustworthy or that this person has a tendency to lie. You guys could already be dealing with this person here. Now, with new love, you know, for me, it could represent someone that you've been dealing with for the last few weeks, a month to two months or something like that. Someone's true colors are starting to show here, okay? We have uh, the lovers, Gemini energy, the seven of swords, king of wands, Aries, Wheel, Sag, Sagittarius energy with the temperance card, cancer, Scorpio, Pisces with the knight of cups. We also have the ace of swords here too, the lovers and the knight of swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Here is the thing. This person might be telling you everything that you want to hear, okay? This person might be painting a very pretty picture here for you, but I also feel like this person's definitely trying to rush it. This person's definitely trying to love bomb here. That's a huge red flag, okay? This person has no intentions of really giving you what you want. Even though this person's telling you this, okay? Sometimes in certain situations, you just can't trust person's words like uh, as if it was gold or just trust someone so blindly here, you know? So just really be careful with this individual here. We're gonna take a look and see what else we need to know about this individual. You have the Six of Wands here and the Ace of Swords. This person's coming in with like strong conviction here. Uh, you know, this person's really persuasive here. This person's definitely like in this energy of trying to get you to see things from their lens, which is this like phantom story here, This fake story that they're creating here. This person's trying to gain your trust very quickly here, but this person will deceive you. This person will lie to you here. We have the King of Wands and also the Six of Swords, all right? The um, Temperance card, and also we have the Eight of Pentacles here. And the Knight of Cups and the Eight of Wands. This person is moving things very quickly here. You know, one of the things that I experience in life, you know, and I can say that personally is that anything that's rushed, especially in this type of, type of situation, it's not gonna last. Yeah, because anything that's forced, you know, anything that's forced, you know, it's just really unnatural. It defines the laws of, you know, the natural things that unfold you know so whoever this is you know this person's definitely trying to force something here this person's definitely trying to pray 
on your weaknesses here. So you gotta be careful here. What else do we have here for Pisces? Tell me about this new love, this new person that Pisces is dealing with or will deal with in the future. What does Pisces need to know about this individual here for October 2024? Sun, rising, Venus signs. Ten of Pentacles, okay? Nine of Pentacles. Could be a situation that this person's only here for your money here. Yeah, this person's here for you. This person's here for your money. This person's definitely trying to show you a good time. This person's definitely trying to butter you up here, you know? This person's definitely trying to take care of you. This person's trying to show you a good time in bed here, you know? But this person doesn't really have any sort of intentions of giving you what you want, but this person could be grabby here. There's a lot of pentacles here. This person's only in it for the money. This person's here for you. Like I said, for the money. Because with the Five of Pentacles here, I do feel like this person comes off as someone here who could be very mature here, okay? But also, financially, this person is not doing well here. With the Knight of, Nine of Cups here, this person feels like they hit the jackpot here with you. But like I said, you also have to be careful with this person because this person's intentions are not pure, okay? So let's see what else we have here. Ten of Pentacles. With the three of wands. Yeah, I, you know, this, this is definitely a fantasy that this person's creating here. Nine of pentacles here, and also we got the ten of cups. Page of wands. And the four of wands here. This is definitely a strong soul tie. You know, Four of Wands is a representation of the Twin Flame here. If you guys are into the label here, but if you guys are not, you know, this could be just a very strong soul tie, a very intense connection here, okay? But, you know, I feel like the, whatever this person's creating, whatever image that this person's creating for you here, I don't feel like it's real, all right? The Ace of Wands here, because we did see the Seven of Swords. This person's going to end up betraying you. Yeah, this person's painting a really pretty picture here. This person is going to betray you here. You know, I just feel like this person sees you as someone here who perhaps has it all. I mean, you don't have to be like a millionaire, you know. You could just have, you know, a dinged up car or like a small apartment. You know, this person might see you as someone here who has it all, you know. So, um, whoever this is, like I said, you know, it's just a matter of time that this person be betrays you here. And here's the thing, you know. Um, Pisces, I feel like you might have a history of attracting these types of individuals here that comes from a place of lack. And that takes and takes and takes and takes from you here. You know, so one of the things I feel like you need to work on here is boundaries and really truly trust your discernment and your intuition of who's good and who's bad for you. You know, because a lot of the times, you know, our bodies are very powerful vessels our bodies can tell us what's good for us and what's not good for us here. So it's really important for you to listen to your intuition here. Yeah, this person feels like they hit the jackpot here with you. But what you don't know is that this person's very deceptive. This person's very grabby. This person lies here, okay? So you got to watch out for this one here because I do feel like this person's definitely love bombing you here. Yeah, this person's definitely like telling you everything that you want to hear but trying to butter you up trying to like get you to such a vulnerable place where this person will try and take everything that you have here or attempt you. All right, so Pisces, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. All right, thanks guys. Bye.